one, two, one, two. Hey, what's up? Greetings, family. How you doing? Just want to test out this new lighting. Okay. Some cheap ass lights I bought. <laughs> but it is what it is. Uh, first and foremost, want to thank everyone that came out to the, the conference. Uh, Brother Rich and his wife really enjoyed it. And I think everybody that vended, we all supported one another. We all enjoyed the lecture and the performance from uh, Billy Carson, Shree Master, Dano Grills, and of course, Red and Blue Pill. And then of course, the live performance by Kambada and Brother Rich. I don't usually eat on television because uh, I'm radio trained and we was always taught not to eat on the radio. But this is YouTube. <laughs> Stop playing. <laughs> Um, and I'm not under anybody's um, job description anymore. <laughs> that time I was making 60000 a year, mind you. So, on radio. Wow. I do miss those days, but we keep it moving. I'm making a million dollars now. <laughs> and watch what I mean when I say that. That's called manifestation. Watch. So, I had a, I had a fun time with the audience. I want to apologize to the audience, those that uh, tried to take pictures with me or get a quick reading with me. Look, after I do a lot of stuff and I, towards the end, I am in a whole different mode. I'm in cleanup mode. So sometimes I don't have time to take pictures and 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 do a quick reading because I'm on the move because we're trying to because it's our it's not our venue we have to make sure things are clean cleaned up I'm I'm there breaking down tables and all that which rightfully so the staff is supposed to do that but I always want to leave a good impression because you are no good if you got a bad name out there amongst different venues no good so all those people that are aspiring to be promoters or producers in their prospective territory. Remember, as you've seen it, try to leave it as or at least close to. If you notice the tables were up or they was put down or they was folded up, then fold. If you notice there's garbage certain places, then clean up. That's how you're supposed to do it. Treat venues that you go into as if it was your own home, as if it were your own home, you treat your venues like that. Because if you want it to be a continual home of yours to produce events where you can make finance and allow vendors to come in and enjoy and, and make money, and you want speakers to continue to come, you have to treat the venue as if it is your home, at least, make the attempt to clean up after yourself. So, like I said, I would like to apologize to anyone that I slighted because I was in cleanup mode. Sometimes these venues give me a, um, a certain time we have to get out. So we have to, so when y'all hear me start shouting, please start packing up, please start packing up to vendors also, you know, and I'm gonna have to start doing this, especially if we're renting uh, venues like that. I have to start telling people an hour before so y'all can start breaking down. So by the time the half hour come in, y'all should be at least halfway down. So by the time it's ready to make that roll, boom, we're out. And the security don't complain because this is what the security does. The security monitors and check out everything we're doing. And then they make a complaint for the Monday morning or the Tuesday morning, whatever time they get in. And that, that uh, brings problems to not only myself for coming to come back into a venue like that, but also any other uh, promoters or producers that want to bring an event in there, that magnitude of that capacity. That also gives them a damper to a point they can actually say they don't want us in their venue anymore. So think about it. As a matter of fact, 
It's also written in my book. <laughs> oh, yeah, I cover some grounds in my book. No promotion is bad promotion. All publicity is good publicity. Just spell my name right. Make sure you get this book on Amazon and Kindle. And it's a Black-owned publishing company. Myself and Dr. Africa published this book. So it actually goes to us. Even if it's on Amazon and Kindle, the finance still comes to us. And it goes to Dr. Africa, myself and Dr. Africa. If you do want to order it for your bookstore, please do. You can call call Dr. Africa or hit him up on www.lailaafrica.com or text me. 347-496-1022, and I will contact you, uh, give you, get you in contact with Dr. Africa's office where you can talk to his assistant, not his wife, they have a team over there, they have a team of at least 10 people over there. His, uh, uh, his assistant can also make that call or that purchase and have the book shipped out to you, depending if you need it by, via express or you just want ground transportation real quick. So make sure you get my books. As a matter of fact, all my books, are right now these books are all produced by Dr. Africa or my publisher myself and Dr. Africa are publishers yeah it's a partnership I'm going to support the elder just like the elder support me so every time you buy any of my books it not only supports the elder and his publishing company but it also supports me and my publishing company and the books that I plan on publishing for other people I'm going to publish certain books myself in the near future so I do have King Simon uh, pub production and publication. So if you down, if you got some good material, metaphysics help and everything is well documented and well placed out there and, uh, and you've done the study and the due diligence of editing and all that, I'll be happy to help publish your book or help be a co-partner in publishing your book. That's where I'm looking at into the future also. I'm going to have at least 10 10 core authors that I will work with, male and female, that I will work with as long as uh, co co publishing, where we can do it together. Um, some publishing companies give you straight up advance and do all that, but now I want to co publish. Uh, so both of us can make some finance. We could upload it to Kindle or Amazon and do what we have to do. Everybody's a book, like I said in the audience yesterday. Everybody is a walking book. Everybody's walking mathematics. So once again, got off the subject a little, but once again, I'd like to apologize to all my brothers and sisters that tried to take a picture with me, but I was rolling with the garbage and cleaning up. <laughs> I'll be moving. Y'all see, I'll be moving. I'm only I'm 52 years young. But actually, I add, I always turn it backwards. I'm 25 years old. <laughs> That's right. See, anything the white folks say, I say something different. So they say I'm 52 as far as the cycle of the sun. I've done counter that. I'm 25 years old. And y'all see me on stage, I act like I'm a 25-year-old too. So it's all right. But I wish I was this focused at 25. <laughs> Believe me, I would have been, I would have been a billionaire by now. Not just billionaire in spirit. <laughs> billionaire by now <laughs> i'm a billionaire i'm actually a trillionaire spirit right now but it's coming because i know through my numbers that in my older age is when the success was supposed to come when you study your numbers you understand so i've studied it i'm good at it i am the best at numerovation because i am the inventor of numerovation so i am the best <laughs> Hey, if you're the inventor, you'd be the best at it. <laughs> so just like my man Ra Aku was there, he is a cosmophysician. He is the best at cosmophysics. He invented it. He don't just do he don't just do astrology. He's a cosmophysician. So I gotta give him that respect. He named his system just like I named my system. That's why you don't hear me say numerology too much. I say numerovation because it's a it's a way you motivate people to be their best. And if they take it or not, that's up to them. Some people are slow. Some people, motivation don't kick in. But the 10 basic principle of my numerovation system that will take hold for the next millenniums, I'm telling you, it's going to take hold. 
is imagination, visualization, affirmation, ambition, application, dedication, organization, preparation, manifestation. And after you do all of that, the 10th one is circulation. Because when you circulate funds, it comes back to you tenfold. So, once again, I want to thank everyone that came out. And I am looking forward to seeing you come out November the 10th. Now, at that event, we don't have the whole hall. We don't have both halls. We only have the theater and that long corridor space that goes all the way to the door. We have that. Any changes, we'll probably make certain changes, but we cannot go into the room where the monitor is, where we where Blue Pill was set up with the food, where Kate, uh, Brother Richard's wife, was set up with the food. We only can accommodate one area. So it is important that we stay focused in that area. The security might be a little lenient with us. It's cool, but I want to be respectful. We're not dirtying up that area. We're going to keep that area clean as possible. And I promise, well, no, I assure, because I don't make promises. Promises are comfort to a fool. I assure you that I'm going to shake everybody's hand. I want to shake everybody's hand for my 24th celebration, because from the, all over my heart, not the bottom of my heart, from all over my heart, I really, really respect and love everyone that shows their support. And those that have supported me over the years, those that have known me in the reggae world, the Calypso world, soca world, Reggae radio, Caribbean radio, urban mix radio. I really, really am happy. Remember, it's 24 years professionally that I was doing promotion when I started at SOBs. But I've been doing it since I was 12 years old. And that's about 40 years. And like in my book, my book uh, that's coming out, my um, autobiography is called When the Late Bell Rang, uh, A Scandalous and Constructive Life of a Promoter. When that book come out, you'll hear the story about me being born in a nightclub. The year my father opened the nightclub was the year that I was born. <laughs> Which, by coincidence, no, it's no coincidence. No coinky dinks. By no coinky dink, it's a number five year. 1967 is number five year. And number five is the lead number of promotion and production. <laughs> coinky dink? Nah, not coinky dink. Oh. <laughs> so my book, when I'm 52, 25 now, uh, we'll be releasing that in my 55th birthday. So you got like three more years. 55th birthday. So that's going to be fun because it's going to, it's going to, it's like similar to this, but this more is more motivational. My, but my promotion book is more motivational for you to motivate because even got sponsorship, how to get sponsors. And the basics of getting sponsorships is in my book. It's funny, I haven't really used sponsorship in the conscious forum i've just worked with people instead of we've always just paid for it ourselves but sponsorship can be very helpful i remember back in the day of my promotions in the 90s um we we landed a deal of one hundred and twenty five thousand dollars for a weekly reggae presentation with at&t see once you write the your your goals and write your um, your intentions, so to speak, or your mission statement, and then you present these these different things to these companies that need signage or they need more people to join. This same thing can be translated into this realm too, because people are doing it. If you see sponsor logos at the bottom of flyers or on the back of flyers or the bottom of posters, those people are sponsors that they definitely solicited them to get their sponsorship, whether it's drink sponsorship, whether it's water sponsorship, whether it's money or finance sponsorship. In my book, we talk about that. And I dropped the knowledge on it. And I gave the different scenarios on it. So 
No promotion is bad promotion, and all publicity is good publicity. Just spell my name right. Good book. And not just because I wrote it, because I did some real good information in there from my life and what we did and all the shows that we were doing. <laughs> so, again, November the 10th, it's going to be black tactless <laughs> and um it's gonna be a smaller event probably about 150 200 people we're going for that amount keep it small and i might broadcast right here on youtube for like ten dollar donation all you have to do is send my cash app and i'll send you the link my cash app is king uh king uh dollar sign king simon 3158 that's dollar sign king simon 3158 and if you want to, if you want to be a part of that, and PayPal too, you can PayPal me at um, www.paypal.com. Uh, no, it's paypal.com. No, paypal.me forward slash King Simon. www.paypal.me forward slash King Simon. All right. But if you just want to send a donation, beautiful. Cash app. Again, dollar sign. King Simon 3158. And those are my sigil numbers. 3158 is my sigil numbers. Three is my alignment number, which deals with expression and expansion, but also speaking sense and being and being very careful with communication. Number one represents creative or creativity, trailblazer, being very overly ambitious, um, being a go-getter. Uh, number five represents the freedom, travel, movement, adaptability, and flexibility. And number eight represents money, power, finance, ancestral connection, old soul energy. So. Yeah, you got to know your sigils, family. That's all you have to do. Know your sigils and just really resonate on the higher energies of each one of those numbers, the higher interpretation. Now, like I've always said, there's duality in all numbers. And once you recognize there's duality in all numbers, man, you're blessed with some form of guidance. Once you understand the duality of numbers. Putting on my blue blockers. Big up to KT, the arts degree. He was selling so many of them. <laughs> Dr. Africa is the one that recommended the Gunner glasses to me about three years ago. And I got like two pairs. And then KT, I got these. When KT referred to me, I got these. I kept them moving. So I got like three, four pairs of them. Some I travel with, some I leave. But these are the glasses that block certain energies and certain radiation from the computer so and the lights that i have because i got these new lights and these lights are bright i might have to turn these things around but they didn't cost that much i just wanted to make sure hold on yeah they didn't cost that much but they work and uh they're bright as hell though <laughs> they're bright as hell <laughs> so uh if hell is bright whatever that means so these little few minutes, I just want to come on, say that November 10th, we're doing it. Also, the day before that, November 9th, I'll be at the Alhambra Ballroom with Ash Cash, King Na, Brother Quazy. Live performances will be there. I think it starts at 2. And let me see that flyer. I got that flyer somewhere. It's, um, it's called Turn Your Social Media Followers Into Money. You can do it. I've done it. All these gentlemen have done it. King Nye is a 13-year-old entrepreneur with over over 10,000 followers. I mean, I'm up to 8,000, but I grow mine organically. Y'all don't see me too much out there. I just promote and do what I do, but it's growing. And it's all about them hashtags. Ooh, them hashtags be helpful. <laughs> Hashtag your stuff, people, if you want to build your network. But this is going to be called on uh, November the 9th. It's called the Second Annual Business Expo and Networking Event. Turn your social media followers into money. Speaker King Nash, 
uh, Ash Cash, myself, King Simon, and and my brother Quazy. He is the producer of it for live performances. Doors open at 2 p.m. 6 p.m. We finish. Alhambra Ballroom is right there across the straight street from the State Building, the Harlem State Building. That's 2116 Adam Clayton Power Boulevard, uh, Junior. Uh, Adam Clayton Power Junior Boulevard, and tickets are 25 early bird until September 30, $30 until October 1st to November 1st and more at the door. You can go to their um, event right at second annual, that's 2ND uh, Business Expo, Expo, that's secondbusinessexpo.eventbrite.com, that's secondbusinessexpo.eventbrite.com, or give Brother Quasi a call at 347- Four nine six two three nine zero. That's three four seven four nine six two three nine zero. Great, we're gonna have a good time over there. If you want tickets from my event, bright for November tenth, the day after, with KT the Arch Degree and his beautiful wife, the Oracle, Moncho and Nawasha of the Acoma. House Initiative. They are the inventor of the alternative to Valentine's Day where their love days last for seven days. So black man and black woman is loving on each other for seven days. Isn't that beautiful? When we should, we should love each other every day, but at least they've opened up the way for a love day, not just on Valentine's Day, named after some saint that actually was about eating hearts and all kinds of craziness. I don't know. Woo, we need to pay attention to history. Woo. And um, <laughs> it is what it is. I studied that type of history. I got the book too on that too. Um, but they have created a natural love day for the balance, man and woman, man, woman, and child. And I'm really, a, I'm really, a, I'm really happy that they're going to be there. More than likely, they're going to close right before I get on. I'm going to be really the closer. But right before they get on, we're going to do what we got to do. Also, uh, Abundance Child will be coming with her food. Of course, I'll be speaking to her uh, also on this YouTube channel, so make sure you pay attention to that. So Abundance Child will be speaking and will be coming with her Drop Squad Kitchen Cuisine. If you never tasted some food, you're going to taste it that day, my girl. Because y'all know... She lives in Delaware, and if she was living in New York, she would always be one of my vendors because me and her have a special connection to each other as business partners and friends for many years. And then my boy Joshua Sara, poet extraordinaire, teacher extraordinaire, especially mathematician. And he connects the math with the DNA and the RNA, and he just does some interesting stuff. So serious. <laughs> He's serious on my shirt. I'm serious. I'm very serious. And get your tickets at kingsimonproductions.eventbrite.com. That's kingsimonproductions.eventbrite.com. Scroll down and click on. Or you can pay via Cash App or PayPal. That's www.paypal.me uh, forward slash King Simon. That's triple W dot paypal dot me forward slash king simon okay so once again it will not be live streamed on usa live stream we're more than likely going to try to live stream it on youtube depending on the connection if it's not boom we'll just throw up sporadic stuff i'll just film sporadically of each speaker for like a few minutes and then cut it off and then go to the next speaker all right so my family have a great day afternoon and evening those in Georgia, I'm coming down south. I'll be down south for probably a good three to four months. So I'll be in Georgia for a little minute. I'll be doing the lectures, a few events out there from um, December 5th. That's Thursday, December 5th. I will be with Jasmine, Jasmine Little, Chakra Healing, Chakra 101, and Numerology 101. I'm going to be doing Numerology 1010. Because <laughs> it's numerovation, baby. Not 101, it's 1010. <laughs> so I'm going to be doing that with her on December the 5th. It's $35. Make sure you go to her website for tickets. That's just be great, the number five. That's just be great, the number five dot com. Just be great, the number five dot com. 
I'll be down in Georgia, Stone Mountain, Georgia, actually, over there, Stillwell's Emporium. That's Stillwell's Emporium. That's 945 Main Street. I want to see y'all there. We're going to have some fun. We're going to go in, but you're going to learn. You know, like Kevin Hart said, you're going to learn today. Well, you're going to learn that day. <laughs> Believe me. That I'm going to be in Florida. I believe I'm doing some events with uh, Denicio. I'm going to contact him. He got some big venues out there in Miami, and he's doing a lot of concert stuff out there. That's my boy. We used to do a lot of reggae concerts out here in New York. He's a Gemini, June the night, so big up to him all the time. And um, so, hope to see y'all. Remember, my website is kingsimonproductions.wordpress.com. KingSimonProductions.wordpress.com, Eventbrite, KingSimonProductions.eventbrite.com, social media, King Simon Productions, IG, King Simon Productions, Facebook, King Simon, Facebook, MC Simon, Facebook, King Simon Prod, that's P R O D, King Simon Prod, short for production, at Twitter. And I know I'm on LinkedIn and a few other places, but I just haven't. Delved, delved into LinkedIn. I'm about to because I understand it's a good business network, especially with the million and billionaires. So since I'm going for them billions, <laughs> I'm damn serious. I am not joking. Um, I'm going for them billions. So it's going to kick in very strong next year for 2020. All right? I love you. I respect you. I honor you. And if you want to do a numeral ovation session, please text me. The full name and date of birth. Remember, I don't do readings. I do consultation to show you how your numbers work for you. High, low, good, bad. What benefits you to be your best? Everything is in your hands when you mathematically understand it. Be safe. Be blessed. Be respectful of yourself. Love yourself. And then your love will show to other people. King Simon, your brother's out of here. Peace.